If you take a look at the career of Ron Guidry, it's almost comical that he is not enshrined in Cooperstown. In his 14 seasons, all with the Bombers, Louisiana Lightning won 170 games and lost just 91. He won back-to-back -back ERA titles in 1978 and 1979 and won 20 games three times, something Nolan Ryan only did twice. He was also an expert at fielding his position, winning five gold gloves in his 14 seasons. In 1978, Guidry had the greatest pitching season in the history of baseball. He went 25-3 with a ridiculous 1.74 ERA in the AL East to earn him the AL Cy Young and a second-place finish in the MVP voting. That same season, he set the Yanks' single-game strikeout record with 18, a record that still stands to this day. If you have ever been to a big league game and were curious as to why fans stand up and cheer with two strikes, it was Gator's 1978 performance that started the tradition. Guidry followed up his historic 78 season with another gem in 79, going 18-8 with a 2.78. He demonstrated greatness deep into his career as well, going 22-6 with a 3.27 in 1985. And just to top it off, the Southpaw has the 28th best winning percentage in the history of baseball at .651. And out of the players ahead of him, 12 are or will be in the Hall of Fame. The rest pitched prior to the live ball era. A two-time champ, four-time All-Star, five-time Gold Glove winner, two-time ERA champion, 1978 Cy Young and MLB Player of the Year, Ryan Guidry is one of the biggest Hall of Fame snubs in baseball history.